grandma's party? Y'all like this new song? <laughs> Listen, so here's the plan. Tonight is my grandmommy's, um, yes, it's her Christmas party. And so I know it's dark, but just hang on because I couldn't let this slide by without showing you what I'm taking, right? Let me bring it over. Because when somebody asks me like, Tanny, um, did you want to bring something? Oh, me, me, I'll bring the salad, right? So let me just show you what I've got right here. Here's my travel bag. And in here, I've got the dressing split up with a little envelope, but I have my... This can be found under my ranch replacement video on YouTube, but I added in some poppy seeds, and now it's poppy seed ranch. Do y'all see that? Look, very store-bought tasting and looking. Look at that. Also, because after all, I want everybody to try my food and say, Tanya, it's so good! And if they don't try it, then I'll bring it all home with me, and that's all good, right? So this is red pepper dressing, creamy red pepper. This has mango, um, apple cider vinegar, red bell pepper, hemp seeds, uh, dates, garlic powder, onion powder, and a little bit of Mexican Fiesta spice. Let's see, look at it. Again, very store-bought tasting, okay? Then, I have my Star Crackers, baby, which I have on my um, Instagram and Facebook yesterday. Look at them. And then I have, and then I have a date too for the party. And then you have to see what the salad is because this is ridiculous. Hey. Okay, let me show you. A sec. Look at it. Bam. That is epic. Excuse me. I'm trying to video. <laughs> You know what the point is? I'm gonna take food that I can eat so I can make sure that I have everything I need and nothing I don't, and I'm gonna feel good after, and, and I'm gonna fit my clothes, you know, and I'm gonna feel like dancing, and people are gonna be like, dang, that food's pretty good, and she seems to be growing younger. Look what you got. <laughs> What are you doing? I, no, I, there's no truck light in here, but I was just thinking about something. Carly was saying the other day that she got some earth balance butter to go on some kind of potato. She was doing skillet, you know, coated, and she had all the, the fresh ground flax seeds on there and all this stuff, and she was like, why, Mom, why do people feel the need to put my butter on their carcass why like they're wasting my stuff like i don't mind if you use it but that's just like totally defeating the point but the thing is just don't worry about it like i was just thinking to myself <laughs> oh they can't see you <laughs> it's dark in here he's like the mystery dude isn't he but i was just thinking to myself like it's hot in here i'm sweating I was thinking that, like, my crackers, I don't really like people to pile on, like, turkey carcass and, you know, giblet gravy and, and the kind of stuffing that's been cooking inside of the guts of a bird with the juices on there. You go straight. And so, but the thing is, it's okay. Like, I just want to make sure, my goal in this is to make sure I'm bringing food for me, right? Because nobody else is worried about that. Nobody's worried, is Tanya going to have something to eat? Or they don't even understand what a vegan is around here, right? Because that's what they call it. So, but my daughter is all excited about the crackers. And see, really, if you just have one partner in crime, it's really great, right? <laughs> so, me and my girl. So, I just want to say that. So, just remember that. Just show up with your love and light and with food to feed yourself. That is the key to success. See you later, alligators. Bye.